Now, your latest headlines and seven first alert forecast from 7 Action News. Sponsored by Henry Ford Health System. All for you. Good evening, I'm Anu Prakash. Breaking news, an arrest has been made in an attempted bank robbery in Madison Heights. We first told you about this last night on 7 Action News at 11. The attempted robbery happened at the Chase Bank inside Hollywood Markets on North Campbell Road. Warren police say they went to the suspect's home when they saw him get in a vehicle and take off. They chased him from Warren all the way to Wayne State's campus downtown. They say he lost control and crashed into a fence at Anthony Wayne Drive and Warren in Midtown. And it didn't end there. He then ran into a parking lot and tried to carjack a Wayne State student. There was a fight between that student and the suspect before police caught up to them and took that suspect into custody. Detroit police are hoping to reunite this dog with its family this holiday. They say they found the pup shivering underneath a parked car around 4 o'clock this morning at the corner of Webb and 14th on the west side. We're told she's house trained and has a pink harness. The DPD's third precinct is keeping her for the night and will take her to animal control tomorrow. If you know who this dog belongs to, please call Detroit police. Now let's get a check on the forecast with Chief Meteorologist Dave Rexroth. Listen, it's cold out there right now, but the temperatures do not drop off tonight. So we're in the low to mid 20s in Detroit. We'll go 26 tomorrow morning. It's chilly for the shoppers, but look at the warm up. Some sunshine, most if not all of the day on Friday. That gets us to 43. 45 is the average high this time of year. We'll beat that both days, Saturday and Sunday, even though we'll have rain most of Saturday. Uh, that's a soggy day. It's a little bit better in terms of drying out on Sunday, but it's not real bright with the sun. All right, Dave, thank you. Those are your 7 Action News headlines. We have those stories and more on our website, WXYZ.com, and on our app. Have a great night. These have been your latest headlines and 7 First Alert forecast from 7 Action News. Sponsored by Henry Ford Health System. All for you.